spiritual practice and spiritual attainment is not becoming someone special in life. See? Are we carrying less burden on ourselves? I am man, I am woman, I am rich, I am poor, I am Malayali, I am Bengali, I am sannyasi, I am grastha, I am educated, I am over-educated. In addition to that, I am spiritual. Ram, Ram, Ram. See? The fan is, the fire is, the man is, the movement is, the health is, the disease is, that easiness is the common denominator. This ease becomes many because of addition of specificities. Now take my favorite example. Man is one. Now this man becomes father, the man becomes husband, the man becomes son. So what is happening? We have added some specialities to that man. And as a result of the specialities, out of one man, three things are born. And who is miserable in life is these three things. The son can never be happy because of father. The husband can never be happy because of wife. The father can never be happy because of son. But the man is never miserable because he is a common denominator. If we really mean spiritual practice, what is essential is we have to discard all those things because of which we have dropped our originality and we have become artificial. See friends, like you know suppose there is some uh, disease. So disease is nothing but some external antigen has entered in our body as a result we get unhealthy. Then we take medicine for what? For fighting with those bacteria and after they are fought out, the medicine is also thrown out of the body. Medicine doesn't remain. We purchase expensive soaps because our body is dirty. So that soap we apply to our body. Then, no, yaar, I have spent many rupees on purchasing this soap. I can't wash it away. Let it remain. No. We wash it out. In the same manner, spiritual life is we have to drop. All that can be dropped. And that which we cannot give up, that is our essential nature. See friends, so what can we drop? We can drop our body identification. When we are not identified with the body, still we continue to exist. In dream we are, may not be a waker but we are. In deep sleep we may not be waker dreamer but we are. We can never experience our absence. That eternal presence has to be asserted. And for asserting them, the wrong notions must be discarded. It is for this purpose we are studying all the spiritual practice. Mm -hmm.